pay attention to. You're a little bit out of, your setup isn't proper. When you go to push your hips back and slide your hands down your thighs to touch the top of your knees, your arms should be hanging directly underneath your shoulders. Now, in this case, that's not what's happening. Your arms are too far out. Yeah, you're reaching too much for it. Um, so that's a little bit out of balance. Then the takeaway, pretty good. Right on plane, I don't have any problems with that. You got a lot of knee flex on the backswing. Your pelvis sort of drops underneath you. Um, do you have a back issue? Right. So this is all right. Coming down, the club gets a little underneath the plane there. You see that, that cone area is where the club pet should travel. Your pelvis is moving a little toward the ball. That's why... I was saying, your pelvis thrusts, early extension, that left leg, when it starts to straighten, guess what? You won't, you won't do that. So the hands are very high at impact. Pelvis is forward a little bit. That pushes the face open. Yeah, I like the neutral grip with the driver. The thing I want to impress upon you is a little more outside on the takeaway and the backswing, your right arm sort of collapses. If you could keep your, your swing a little shorter by keeping the right arm a little straighter on the backswing, you know, that would also keep the club more in front of you. See this right arm, it's very collapsed. It, yeah. You know, getting the hands up a little higher would be helpful for you. Now, you could do that by just, you know, on the backswing, just keeping that right arm a little more extended. Now, again, I don't think that's a good swing thought for the course, but it's something you could work on.